Hello guys, how are you? I hope that you are doing good. This is Adam and this is the M4 MacBook Air and this is the base model with 16 uh, gigabyte of RAM and 256 storage. I have a Blender open and this is the most recent version of a Blender that you can see on the screen right now. And also with a Blender, I have the junk shop scene here. What we will start with is cycles supported with GPU compute. That is going to be the very first test that we will be doing and it will be the jank shop so render image we are going to wait and then see what we will be getting we got a 21 seconds to render one frame from the jank shop which if you want to test that a project yourself i will have the link in the description so you can go there and then test it and again for a base model and using the gpu on a mac using blender this is actually excellent and it only took a 21 seconds. In terms of the CPU, and if I know a thing or two about SOCs, it should be actually double just because usually the CPU is, is slower than the GPU and then the GPU since it's optimized for AI and such which means the cores are more powerful without getting too technical basically the cores for the GPU they are more powerful to render in comparison for example to the M1 that we had before so we will go ahead and we will do cycles supported and then the CPU and we will see how long it would take for it to render yeah. we have our second run and then that is the run that use the CPU and then what we got is 53 seconds and as I said probably it's going to be double than the GPU and I was correct so we got 53 seconds right here for the sake of of luxury of time here is the rest of the results from the house churro and then as well the fox splash and the conclusion from all of this is two things that we can take in terms of a blender it's good using the m4 you can render with it and especially after apple and a blender actually worked together and, and they had some type of partnership around two years ago and also in terms of uh, the results as you can see the GPU is way better than the CPU where it's at least two times to four times faster where in the splash a project it's actually the GPU four times faster than the CPU so please keep that in mind and by the way the future set is slower than the supported set so always use the supported set and do not use anything else so i did not include the future set because they were just slower in general and uh, that is your results and the next video we will be diving deep into maya and then seeing how maya would perform with the m4 and then after that we should take a look at unreal engine 5 and unreal engine 4 as well do not forget to subscribe if you think i earned it and have a wonderful day